Welcome to the presentation of Biz Broadcast, an automated report delivery solution where we will insert our distribution template into a workbook and define how we send out reports, who will get the report, and which report tabs they will get. And when combined with Biz Insight, will allow us to use a single report template to automatically burst multiple reports out by location or user-defined parameter. To start, begin by opening up BizNet software in the Excel toolbar, and we will insert the new distribution template into our workbook and then begin to send, fill out the different parameters. The first is the format. We can choose any of 11 different formats. We'll use PDF for this particular instance. And I can find a path or an email too. And here I can send it to a single recipient, a list of recipients, or use Microsoft Outlook groups. For email subject, I'm going to use a formula that combines a text reference, monthly report, and I'm going to refer to my selection tab or selection cell which we define which tabs in the spreadsheet we're going to send for a more descriptive email subject. And we do that as such. The selection tab allows us to define which tabs in the spreadsheet that we want to send to this particular recipient. For this instance, I'm going to use dash for dashboard and rolling for our rolling income statement. And for file name, we'll use uh, the same uh, as our email subject. To send the report out, we're going to go to our Run Now in, tool, in our BizNet toolbar. And when we do, it goes out, opens up our report, refreshes the data, and bursts the report out in a PDF format. And I'm going to go out to Microsoft Outlook where it's ready to go out. In the next report, I'm going to use additional parameters. And here's a couple, including sending attachments. But I'm going to define this one, and I'm going to use Location as a parameter that we want to send the report out and define. And I'm going to open up the location tab. And here we have a cell reference we use to cycle through the different locations in our report. And I'm going to create a name range for that cell reference simply by going to the box. Instead of J2, it will now be name range location. And we'll go back into our biz broadcast report template and begin to build the report. And I'm going to take this report and we're going to send it as an Excel static value spreadsheet and we'll send it to manager at report.com and again we'll use a formula in our email subject to get a more descriptive email subject and instead of using a selection tab I'll use location uh, as a reference for our email subject name. Uh, we're going to use the location tab LOC uh, and then we'll use the file name. We'll simply copy the email subject. And I'm going to define the first parameter as Dallas. And I can take and copy this row down and add some additional rows and simply change the location parameter and burst this report out, single report out, to multiple people by multiple locations using a single report and simply changing our location parameter to Atlanta and to New York. And to send the report out, we're going to open up our BizNet software toolbar. And we'll collect, we'll click on our Run Now button again. And it'll cycle through the reports by opening them up, refreshing the data, changing our parameter from all to Dallas to Atlanta and then to New York. And then it will burst these reports out to the recipients and we'll go out to our Outlook and take a look at one of them, Atlanta. And you can see that when we open up the Atlanta report that's going out, we'll have a single report that contains one tab location for the specific Atlanta location. For more information on Biz Broadcast, contact us at bizsales at biznetsoftware.com or call at 888-803-5227 or visit biznetsoftware.com to view other videos.